Do you know the signs of kidney disease? This question is more important than you may think. Kidney disease is often a silent killer, sneaking up on people without them even knowing it. It's a condition that slowly creeps up, often unnoticed until it's too late, but if detected early, its progression can be slowed or even stopped. That's why knowing the signs is so crucial. In the next few minutes, we're going to delve into this topic and uncover 12 signs your kidneys may be in trouble. These signs could be subtle, easily mistaken for other health issues, or they might be glaringly obvious. The key is to take note and act promptly. So whether you're just curious or you're concerned about your kidney health, this information is vital. Stay tuned as we uncover these 12 signs and remember, early detection can be a lifesaver. Delving right in, the first sign is a change in your urinary function. Now, our kidneys are responsible for producing urine, so it's no surprise that any shifts in this function can be a clear indicator that something might be off. You might experience a dramatic increase or decrease in the amount of urine you produce. The color might also change, turning darker or even cloudy. And let's not forget about the frequency. You might feel an urge to urinate more often, even during the night, or, conversely, you might feel the need to go but can't. These changes might seem small, but they're definitely not something to brush off. They could be your body's way of signaling that your kidneys are not working as they should. Keep track of these changes and consult your doctor if anything seems out of the ordinary. The second sign is difficulty or pain during urination. This symptom can be quite disconcerting as it disrupts a basic daily function. Urinating should not be a strenuous or painful task. If it becomes one, it could be a sign of a urinary tract infection, commonly known as a UTI. This type of infection is caused by bacteria entering the urinary system, and it can cause a variety of uncomfortable symptoms. One of the most notable is a burning sensation or pain during urination. However, a UTI is more than just a minor inconvenience. If left untreated, the infection can spread upward into the kidneys, leading to more serious health issues. So, it's crucial to pay attention to this symptom and seek medical help if you experience it. Moreover, if you notice a fever or neck pain in conjunction with difficulty or pain while urinating, it's even more critical to seek medical attention immediately. Look out for fever and neck pain accompanying this symptom. The third sign, blood in the urine, is a direct cause for concern. This is not a symptom to take lightly. When blood is present in the urine, it's a clear signal that something is not right within the urinary tract. This could be due to issues ranging from kidney stones or infections to more serious conditions like kidney disease or even bladder cancer. It's important to understand that blood in the urine might not always be visible to the naked eye. Sometimes it's only detected under a microscope during a routine medical examination. Regardless of how it's found, the presence of blood in the urine should never be ignored. This symptom is a loud cry for attention from your body. It's your body's way of saying, hey, something's wrong here, I need help. So if you notice blood in your urine, it's crucial to seek medical attention immediately. Don't wait. Early diagnosis can make a significant difference in your treatment options and overall health. Foamy urine is the fourth sign we are discussing today. Now what do we mean by foamy? Well, it's when your urine has so many bubbles it starts to resemble a frothy, foamy substance. This might seem harmless, just a curious quirk of your body. But actually, it could be a sign that something more serious is happening. Foamy urine can suggest there's an excess of protein in your urine, a condition known as proteinuria. This is not normal. Your kidneys should be filtering out excess protein, keeping it in your body where it's needed. When they aren't doing their job properly, that protein can end up in your urine, causing it to foam. So, if you notice your urine appearing foamy, don't ignore it. It could be a sign that your kidneys are not filtering properly. As with any symptom, if it persists, it's important to seek medical advice. Uh, swelling or edema is the fifth sign that your kidneys may be in danger. This is a condition characterized by an excess of watery fluid collecting in the cavities or tissues of the body. Now you might be wondering, what does this have to do with your kidneys? Well, your kidneys are responsible for filtering waste products from your blood and excreting them through urine. But when your kidneys aren't functioning properly, they may fail to remove these waste products and excess fluid effectively. This can lead to fluid retention, causing swelling in various parts of your body. Most commonly, this swelling or edema is noticeable in the feet, ankles, but it can also occur in the face and hands. So if you notice unusual swelling, especially in these areas, it's important not to dismiss it. It could be a sign that your kidneys are struggling and need attention. Moving on to the sixth sign, extreme fatigue. Our kidneys aren't just waste removal specialists. 
they also play a vital role in red blood cell production. They do this by secreting a hormone called erythropoietin, which signals your body to create more red blood cells. These cells are essential for transporting oxygen around your body, keeping you energized and alert. However, when your kidneys are not functioning optimally, they produce less of this hormone, resulting in fewer red blood cells being produced. Fewer red blood cells mean less oxygen being transported, leading to muscle cells and your brain not receiving enough oxygen. This can cause you to feel tired and weak even after a full night's sleep. If you're experiencing unexplained extreme fatigue, your kidneys might be the reason. It's important to listen to your body and not disregard such symptoms, as they could be a silent plea for help from your kidneys. The seventh sign is dizziness and inability to concentrate. It's not unusual to feel a bit off-kilter or distracted from time to time, especially when dealing with stress or lack of sleep. However, if you're noticing a persistent sense of dizziness or a sudden difficulty focusing, it might be more than just daily life wearing you down. Kidney issues can lead to reduced oxygen flow to the brain. Without the optimal amount of oxygen, the brain struggles to function properly. This can result in feelings of dizziness and problems with concentration. It's like trying to run a car without adequate fuel. It just doesn't work as it should. So if you're regularly feeling dizzy or finding it hard to focus, don't just brush it off as tiredness or stress. It might be a sign that your kidneys are having a tough time. A sudden inability to concentrate or frequent dizziness might be more than just a lack of sleep. The eighth sign is feeling constantly cold, even in warm environments. Now this might seem a little odd, but there's a reason behind it. You see, the kidneys play a vital role in the production of red blood cells. When the kidneys aren't functioning correctly, they can't produce enough of a hormone called erythropoietin, which is necessary for the creation of these red blood cells. This can lead to a condition known as anemia. One of the symptoms of anemia is feeling cold all the time, regardless of the temperature around you. On top of that, kidney infections can also manifest as fever and chills, making you feel cold even when you're tucked up under a blanket. It's important to note that while feeling constantly cold is a common symptom of kidney disease, it can also be caused by a host of other health issues. Feeling cold all the time could indicate an issue with your kidneys. The ninth sign is skin rashes and itching. These skin symptoms can be particularly vexing and are a result of waste buildup in the blood. When the kidneys aren't functioning optimally, they struggle to filter out toxins from the blood. These toxins then circulate throughout the body and can manifest on your skin as rashes and cause persistent itching. What you might initially brush off as an allergic reaction could be a sign of something much more serious. These rashes can appear anywhere on the body, often accompanied by a strong desire to scratch. The itching can be severe and may become worse at night. It's important to note that topical creams and ointments may offer temporary relief, but they won't solve the underlying problem if it's related to kidney function. If you're experiencing persistent rashes and itching, it might be more than just allergies. It's crucial to consult with a healthcare professional to rule out kidney disease. The tenth sign is ammonia breath and a metallic taste in the mouth. The kidneys are the body's natural filtration system. They remove waste from the bloodstream, which is then excreted in our urine. However, when the kidneys aren't functioning correctly, waste products can accumulate in the blood. One such waste product is urea. When the kidneys fail, the levels of urea in the blood can increase. This urea then breaks down into ammonia in the saliva leading to a foul-smelling breath, often described as similar to the smell of ammonia. Additionally, this increase in urea can also cause a metallic taste in the mouth. It's like suddenly finding a coin on your tongue when you haven't been anywhere near a piggy bank. So remember, a sudden metallic taste in your mouth or bad breath could be a sign of kidney trouble. The eleventh sign is persistent nausea and vomiting. This isn't about feeling queasy after a roller coaster ride or a rich meal, we're talking about a constant feeling of nausea and recurrent episodes of vomiting. Why would that happen, you may wonder? Well, when kidneys aren't functioning properly, waste products and toxins build up in the bloodstream. This waste buildup is a poison of sorts to your body, and it can make you feel persistently nauseous. In some cases, this nausea results in vomiting as your body tries to expel these waste products. This is more than just an inconvenience. It's a sign that your kidneys may not be doing their job. If you're frequently experiencing nausea and vomiting, it's time to consult a doctor. Remember, these symptoms could indicate a serious issue, and it's always better to be safe than sorry. The twelfth and final sign is shortness of breath. 
Now this isn't your typical out of breath feeling after a strenuous workout or a brisk walk. It's a persistent breathlessness that doesn't quite fit with your level of activity or health. This happens because severe kidney disease can cause fluid to build up in the lungs, making it difficult for you to catch your breath. Moreover, kidneys play a vital role in producing a hormone that instructs your body to create red blood cells. These cells are responsible for carrying oxygen to every part of your body. When your kidneys aren't functioning properly, they may not produce enough of this hormone, leading to anemia. Anemia, in turn, can leave your body starved of oxygen, causing you to feel short of breath. So remember, shortness of breath might not be due to a lack of fitness, but a serious kidney issue. These symptoms don't necessarily mean you have kidney disease. However, they are warning signs that your body may be struggling with kidney health. Changes in your urinary function, pain during urination, blood in the urine, and foamy urine are all signs that your kidneys may not be functioning as they should be. Swelling or edema, extreme fatigue, dizziness, a constant feeling of cold, skin rashes, ammonia breath, a metallic taste in the mouth, persistent nausea, vomiting, and shortness of breath are also symptoms of possible kidney issues. Each of these signs is your body's way of alerting you that something isn't right. Don't ignore these signals. It's important to listen to your body and seek medical attention if you notice these changes. Remember, the sooner a problem is detected, the better the chances are of treating it effectively. Consult a doctor if you notice any of these signs. Early detection can save your kidneys and your life. That's all for today's video on the 12 signs your kidneys might be in danger. Don't let these signs go unnoticed. If you found this information helpful, be sure to give this video a thumbs up. For more health insights and tips, hit the subscribe button and ring that notification bell. We've got plenty more informative videos coming your way. Thanks for watching, and remember, your health is in your hands.